Natural Super Falcons have returned to their base, uh, Brisbane, ahead of their second group game against co-host Australia uh, on Thursday at the World Cup. Uh, we have a report uh, by our correspondent, Emmanuel Akindubuwa, as he takes a look at the Falcons' performance so far at the World Cup. On the dogs, following the very controversial preparation to the tournament. For the Nigerian women to be able to have been able to play a goal extra against the Olympic champion, I think it really goes a long way. You look at the tactical approach of Waldrum, I think that's quite impressive. Up next for the Super Falcons will be a game against the co-host Australia at the Brisbane Stadium on Thursday. The Falcons are expected to get at least a draw from this game to stand a chance of progressing to the knockout stages. Rashida Tajibadi and Alima Tayindi are expected back into the team after sitting out the game against Canada and will be a big boost for the Falcons in this game where Australia's talismanic captain Samantha Kerr will be missing out with an injury. There are lots of expectations that Nigeria, Mr. Godwin and Akin, and believes that the Super Falcons have what it takes to take it one step further and get the needed results against the horses. This was a team you and I didn't give any chance at all. But here they are, they have done very, very well in their first game. Um, Randy one drop the coach is saying that we need peace. Now he's preaching peace. The guests are dancing every day, they are singing every day. Let's beat Australia and get to the next round. You know, sometimes when Nigeria have their backs against the wall, that's when they pull the Niger factor. Striker for Nigeria. Nigeria has always played at the FIFA Women's World Cup. This will be their ninth appearance at the Women's Mundial with their best performance coming at the 1999 edition where they made it to the quarterfinals. At the 2019 edition in France, the team made it to the round of 16 before eventually losing out to the host nation France. Well, the Super Falcons were able to repeat another momentum performance in Australia and New Zealand. We'll wait and see as the Falcons continue their charge at the Women's World Cup. Emmanuel Akindubuwa, TVC News, Lagos.